in Bodhinar, Dr. B. R. Shetra, Bhatta Kanyar. With a lot of happiness and a huge privilege, I accept this honor from the World Wide Foundation. I also want to accept this award on behalf of my wife, my children, Arthi Shetty, Vaishnav, and Shloka. And uh, most importantly, on behalf of my late father, Jaradhan Shetty, my wife, uh, my mother, Sushila Shetty, my father in law, Jarkal Sudhakar Hegde, late Jarkal Sudhakar Hegde, and uh, Mrs. Dilavati Hegde. And my brother-in-law, uh, Adarsh, my sisters, my brother, my brother-in-laws. Everyone had a tremendous role in my life, in my career. And uh, I very sincerely accept this honor on behalf of the entire family. I also want to uh, accept this honor on behalf of thousands of people who work for our group in India and across the world. One of them is here, Dr. Nilatan Shende. Dr. Nilatan Shende is an extremely passionate individual who sincerely wants to serve the society. And we are fortunate to have him in our team to lead the company's CSR program. He has also spent a lot of time here coming here, identifying along with Sudhiranna, who has been the spirit and the energy behind this entire project of the 17 houses. <laughs> what is important is to recognize and identify who are those deserving members of our community and one or two outside our community as well, who truly deserves this support from all of us. I must say, the inspiration of giving these 17 homes came from two thoughts. One was the new home that we built for our family in Bombay, which just got ready in the last couple of years back. And you all must have heard that, you know, I appeared in the newspapers for buying that property in, in Bombay and being able to uh, completely construct the house. And we are now living in that property where the late Rajesh Khanna and uh, Rajendra Kumar stayed in the past. So that inspiration came from, uh, from moving into that home. And also it happened to be on the 25th year of my birthday of my son. Uh, so these two wonderful uh, moments of our life we thought that we are so happy moving to this house. How about sharing our joy with the other people from our community who may need a shelter like this in their life? So that's what God is given <laughs> this inspiration from. And uh, I truly thank the wonderful people here sitting in this dais. Each one of them have contributed in this Dr. Ajay Shetty, Dr. Santram Shetty, Dr. V. R. Shetty, Dr. Sanjeev Rai, Sudhiran, as I already mentioned, and the, uh, my dear friend, uh, Mr. Kushal uh, Hegre, and uh, our own uh, Satishana, uh, Satishana Hegre. So, all of them have directly, indirectly supported this project, and I'm so glad that this has now happened. It's a reality. And the, all these 17 houses have been gifted to the most deserving people of our community. I don't need to tell you how important to have a home. And uh, it not only brings shelter, it not only brings happiness, it also brings security. And most importantly, it brings that self-respect when you have your own house. The combination of that, they are able to bring up good family, good children, 
give them education and uh, it will support their future life for generations. So the impact can be for multi-generations. So that is what has actually uh, inspired me to take up this uh, project as well. I am also very happy these days to see the Ban Sanghas across the country and I actually also have travelled to the UK and the United States, I addressed them this time at the Bana function also, that the Ban community is increasingly coming closer and, and doing some tremendous work for the community and for the society. I see this each time in Bombay under both the associations where I am quite closely involved, the Ban Sangha and the Ban's Association of Mumbai. And they are doing some tremendous work. If you have seen in Bombay, now we have Mr. S.M. Shetty School, which is educating over 10,000 students. We have the Ban Sangha College, four different colleges. They are educating about three or 4,000 students. There are Bansanga in Pune, Bansanga in Bangalore, just inaugurated a beautiful school under the leadership of Dr. Mr. Prakash Shetty. And many other places, a lot of work is going on. And uh, as our community prospers, we all know that Bans are normally a very leadership material. People are going out of the way to build businesses, build their career in whatever that they do, they do it very well. Tremendous doctors and tremendous lawyers, tremendous chartered accountants we saw. And tremendous amount of people who are working internationally in Dubai, in the UK, in the United States. Buns have done exceedingly well. But the beauty about Buns is they don't forget the roots. They always come back to their families for the wedding, for the booth of the cola or whatever. They're, they're all hitting the Bansanga and the other community members. So this is very, very good quality that we have. And also what I have seen among the Bans is that they're, they're always very friendly. They're always there for each other. They stand by. My request to all of you as parents and as elders to continue to build that culture, build that character in your children, in your grandchildren. Go out there, do your best, succeed in a right way and support the community, support your relatives and support the society at large and have a tremendous passion for your country and be proud to be an Indian. To talk a few words about India today, being in the business, I see this every day. India is really shining today. India is very confident today. India, finally the days of, good days of India has come yes. under the Honorable Prime Minister's tremendous effort, dedication and hard work and the vision and the courage that he has shown to lead India and take India to be among the top three countries in the world, which I have no doubt in the next three years or five years, India will become the third largest economy in the world and we should be extremely proud about that. Other very important change that has happened in India, today most Indians have become law-abiding citizens. They pay their taxes, they have fear of law, right? The old habit of not taking away money from the bank or whatever, not giving it back, those days are gone. So, very proud of you, sir. And, uh, I look forward to working with all of you in the future as well to see where I can help, where I can, the society can help. Thank you very much.